Hello, and thank you for joining us. In this video, we'll show you how to use the NewsBank database available to you from the National City Library with your library card. If you don't have a card and would like to sign up for one, I'll include a link in the description below. NewsBank is perfect for students and researchers who are looking for reputable primary and secondary sources. The database has over 8,000 news publications from all over the world, both national and international news sources. To start off, you'll have to visit the National City Library website by going to www.nationalcitylibrary.org. Take note that depending on whether you're using a mobile device or a desktop computer, the website may look different. On a desktop or laptop computer, the website will look like this. From here, on the left-hand side, you'll click on the link for electronic databases. This is a library database page. To find NewsBank, you'll simply click on the newspaper's link and you'll see several databases, two of which are the NewsBank in both English and Spanish. To access them, you can simply click on the logo that says NewsBank. And make note that beneath the logo is a PDF tutorial on how to use NewsBank. On the NewsBank homepage, you should take note of three sections. In the middle is the search bar that allows you to search for topics and names. Above that is the A to Z source list, and that lets you search the publications alphabetically. And below both of these is the suggested topics and quick links section. This is good for when you want to explore a topic but are unsure of where to start. In this example, we'll do some research on climate change. There's two ways you can do this. The first is you can type in the term you're looking for in the search box. And when I click on the search button, you'll see several things. The search results, which include a preview of the article and information about the publication. And on the left, you'll see filters that let you narrow down the search results. In this example, we've pulled more than 4 million search results because the term climate change is a broad term. For a more narrow and focused search, you can use the suggested topics feature. For climate change, we can click on the environment topic. And here you'll see topics pertaining to the environment. One of these topics is climate change. And if we click on that, the search results will have narrowed down considerably, making it easier to find the articles that are relevant. At the top, you'll also notice that there are different operators or Boolean terms. These Boolean terms were automatically applied to help narrow down the search results. There may also be video news reports and the results that you can also view. Click on any of the search results to see the article or report. The search result will have several features that you may find helpful, including a voice to text, the ability to download or email the article, and each article or news report will also allow you to create a citation. All you have to do is choose which information you need for your citation and it will give you the entire citation that you can then copy and paste into your report. And here you can actually use the voice to text search and it'll read out the article to you. For more information on research databases, visit our website at www.nationalcitylibrary.org.